Hi guys, welcome to the RPB Resonance Chemistry. Now we are discussing another important lecture in selectivity classes. Okay. Now in this session, I would like to take the problem which is given in the June 2018 CSIR. June 2018 CSIR for four marker. Okay. So in this session, we, we want to find the like a major product of A and B major product of A and B in the following reaction okay now so by solving the these question to solving these question now what we need to re, uh, solve that question that is first thing is uh, like a phosphorus elide that means Wittig reaction stereochemistry okay again followed by the heating that means a uh, pericyclic reaction stereochemistry so generally pericyclic uh, in this session we, we need uh, 4 plus 2 cycloaddition reaction okay now with the help of these two rules I, I, we will solve the problems uh, very easier manner okay now here the first step uh, that is a uh, Wittig reaction Wittig reaction okay now here two types of carbonyl compounds are there so one is aldehyde compound another one is ketone compound okay okay among the aldehyde and ketone here this is not simple ketone this is alpha beta unsaturated ketone this is also alpha beta unsaturated aldehyde so among these two which is more reactive towards the like a Wittig reaction generally Wittig reagents are less nucleophile Wittig uh, phosphorus elites are less nucleophile over than the phosphonates of uh, like uh, Harner, Wordsworth, Emmons reaction. That's why here the, the uh, phosphorus elites are uh, less nucleophile. That means uh, it reacted with more more reactive species only. Okay. Now here among these two, ketone and uh, aldehyde, aldehyde is more reactive than ketone towards the nucleophilic condition reaction. Aldehyde is more reactive than the ketone. Okay. That's why so our Wittig reaction especially undergoes the aldehyde only okay now here Wittig P pH 3 CH double bond COOE type okay now here these two are eliminated like uh, phosphorus triphenyl phosphonyl oxide is eliminated so that means here pH 3 P double bond O is eliminated now the remaining part is attacked over here okay now here the two types of possibilities either a cis manner or trans manner okay now here it is trans here it is the say so two types of are possible okay now we have discussed uh, very clearly the stereochemistry of uh, uh, like a Wittig reaction mainly depends upon the stabilization of elides so stabilization of uh, elides we have discussed uh, the stabilization of elides so generally elides uh, which are connected to the donating groups which are connected to the withdrawing groups with drawing groups okay so donating groups uh, which is nothing but a no, uh, non stabilized elides with drawing or stabilized elides okay so non stabilized elides will give us the z uh, except uh, closer uh, modification okay so here stabilized elides will give us the two types of product uh, polar and non polar generally it is a uh, e selectivity generally it is e selectivity as there is no case of the solvent well, but that, that's why we will take the stabilization elides will use the e stereochemistry e means the trans stereochemistry we have discussed now in our csr net advanced name of reactions okay over there uh, stereo selectivity of a Wittig reaction is there if you want if you watch the video uh, i'll give the link above okay now here so stabilized elides will use the trans olefins trans olefins now here among these two this is the trans okay so first step we required the Wittig reaction selectivity first of all reactivity then followed by the selectivity okay so which is selectivity stabilized elide okay now here the stabilization of elides will give us the information okay now here among the four options they are given in the two options are trans two options are cis okay now here we will get the only trans product that's why we will eliminate easily those cis products so those cis product now here only we required we we required to eliminate the only one option that is either a or c either a or c now let us go through the second step now in second step here this is the first step of product here it is carbonyl compound here it is the trans product okay here it seems to be like a diene it seems to be diene now here it is oethyl that is a dienophile partner dienophile 
partner. So diene plus a dienophile, that means uh, we will get the, under the heating condition, we will get the cyclic adduct. We will get the cyclic adduct that is called 4 plus 2 deals on the 4 plus 2 cycloaddition reaction. Now here it happens 4 plus 2 cycloaddition reaction. Okay. So 4 plus 2. Uh, everyone know that 4 plus 2 cycloaddition reaction like this. Okay. Now here. Okay. I would like to write over here. Okay. Now here this is the bond. Now here it creates the new bond. This is the carbon-carbon bond. Now here it creates the another new bond. So O ethyl, O ethyl. So double bonds becomes a single bonds, a single bond becomes a double bonds in case of cycloaddition reaction. Now here double bonds becomes a single bond, single bond becomes a double bond, double bond becomes single bond. Uh, so now here it creates a two two new CC bonds, two new CC bonds, one over here, one over here. Okay, this is the new CC bond, this is the new CC bond. Okay, again it having the position that is um, COO ethyl, COO ethyl. So again here it is carbonyls are there. Okay, so this is the general reaction. So 4 plus 2 cycloaddition reaction that gives the uh, such type of option, such type of option. Okay, now uh, now we looked out to the option number A and C. So they are given in the option A. Okay, so they are given in the option A that is 1, 3 position. Now up they are given in the option C, 1, 2 position. Okay, so in generally, so dienes and dienophiles, uh, they are uh, having the, like here it is the electron withdrawing group. In this case, the, there are groups are uh, like reverse. Now here it is the donating group. So whatever the groups, uh, here dienes and dienophiles, uh, they are in same plane. Due to the, like a secondary orbital interaction, they, they both are come to closer, then it becomes the same planar, okay. Now here, so that's why here these two groups are in adjacent. 1, 2 addition is predominant than the 1, 4 addition. 1, 2 addition predominant than the 1, 4 addition. Generally, we would like to take the uh, positions of regioselectivity of Diels order reaction. So that is, okay, now here it is the possibility. Here 1, 2 addition plus it may be possible the bond shifted like this that means uh, here so here this is the 1 3 addition okay 1 3 isomer and 1 2 isomer again uh, another another type of isomer so here 1 3 okay here 1 4 so among these two 1 2 uh, 1 2 rezo isomer is a uh, major this is not again here 1 3 is not major 1 4 ratio isomer is major 1 4 ratio isomer is major so simply it is remembered like this so adjacent position like r the okay now here opposite position that is para okay so in these two cases a meta are uh, least stable that means minor product or the or the paras are major product this is the simplest uh, remembering point regarding to the regio selectivity of Diels order reaction okay now here so uh, diene and dienophile uh, having the only mono substituent they are both individually they having the mono substituent now here one two is major than that of the one three isomer so here uh, a and c so c having the one two isomer D, uh, A having the 1, 3 isomer. That's enough to uh, confirm the our option. Okay, A is not correct. So again, we need some st selectivity. That's why I would like to uh, give the complete information regarding to the stereochemistry of the Diels order reaction. Okay, now the stereo selectivity, uh, stereo selectivity of reaction, that is uh, like here. Okay, here the diene as well as the dienophile. So both having the like mono substituent. Now whenever it, it gives the like a uh, cyclic adduct. Now here the group, the substituent of the diene and the substituent and the dienophile both are in same plane. Both are in same plane due to the secondary orbital interaction. Due to the secondary orbital interaction. This is the same plane, not the opposite plane. Okay, so this is the simplest studio chemistry point. So first point. Now again second point, here it is this trans product, here it is the normal one, okay. So these two groups are trans to each other, under thermal condition it, it becomes a cis, it becomes a cis, why because 4 plus 2 cycloaddition reactions under thermally it is disallowed, okay, that this means a trans becomes a cis, cis becomes a trans, okay. However, so the, here these groups are having the cis, both are the upward direction, that means uh, those, those are cis compounds. Now in the, uh, the cycloaddition, that means the Diels order reaction, they become a trans product. They become a trans product. Now in case of a, a, like a diene partner, like diene partner. So now here, 
This is the dyne having this is uh, geometry. Dyne, uh, sorry, it is a dynophile partner. Dynophile retains their stereochemistry. Retains their stereochemistry. Here, both are same plane. That's why either above the plane or below the plane. If it is a trans product, now here, uh, we will get the trans as a major product. These five are very important roles regarding to the stereochemistry, stereochemical aspect of the Beals order Riash. Now let us go through the our problem. Okay, now here we will get the product like this. Double bond O, here the double bond, here the like a O ethyl. COO ethyl. So in in previous case, uh, this is the reactive intermediate. Okay. So this is the reactive species. Okay. Here these two groups, diene substituent, dienophile substituent, they both becomes uh, like a similar plane. Both becomes a similar plane. Okay. Now here it may, it may be above the plane or below the plane. Doesn't matter. COO ethyl. O ethyl. So first we need the ratio selectivity. That means one two and one three five isomer. Now we need the stereo selectivity. Now here it is the double bond. Here it is the double bond. Oh, okay. Again, uh, they are giving the two types same options, uh, but the position of uh, like a stereo chemistry of hydrogen is different. If we, if you don't know the like a concept of a Wittig reaction, we are confused with the uh, definitely we are confused with the like a stereo chemistry of a Diels order reaction. That's why I'll give the very clear cut information. Now here this is the trans group. Okay, so these two groups, one is a uh, like a right a right side, another one is a downside. Okay, that means uh, these two are trans to each other. In uh, diene partner, trans group becomes a cis. Trans group becomes a cis. Now here it is the below the plane. Then definitely it is the below the plane. So we didn't we didn't uh, represent the ring uh, ring plane. Okay, that's why here it is the below the plane. Hiding hydrogen atom definitely it is the below the plane. Is it okay? Okay, I repeated my sentence. So generally, like uh, these two groups are trans. Okay, trans in Diels order heating condition. This allowed that means it gives the like a uh, cis product. So here these group, these group are in the same plane. That means a uh, cis product. Okay. Now here uh, they are oriented in the trans uh, trans position, but will give the cis product as a major. Now here, so these are two uh, are same plane, but we didn't represent the ring carbon as a uh, like a. Uh, uh, dot, uh, dotted lines that's why uh, we will represent if it is the ring is below the plane so our uh, hiding hydrogen is the above the plane so this is the overall stereo chemistry regarding to the our question okay now absolutely our option is c is a correct c is correct so we know the concept uh, we will easily eliminate the options uh, but we want the very basic concept of the ratio stereo selectivity of each and every reaction so that's why i would like to go through the basic concept of the selectivity okay thank you for watching